Hello everyone, welcome back to Alien Isolation. Um, so Samuels is apparently doing a silly thing, and... Yeah, he's over there. I guess I have to go through here to try and tell him otherwise. So you... Samuels, that's too dangerous. Yes, too Get... Dangerous. Get... Oh. Samuels, don't! Dude. What? It... Oh, come on. Dude, seriously, do you know what a reformat is? Like, come on, do not be this stupid. You are literally a walking computer. You are a hard drive on legs. Come on, think about this. Whoa, I should not be standing near this stuff. Ah! That... That looks like this game's, like, interpretation of what an EMP blast looks like. Then why doesn't it just kill power? Amanda, you need to manually disconnect the system. Please. Jesus, okay. Samuels, Let me know Wait. how. You need to do it in the correct order, or the cascade will be fatal for me. She how fragile is your system? Remove the red cable first. Red cable, okay. red cable. Red That red cable? Not that red cable. Uh, this red cable? Bring me this red cable. I hope it's this red cable. This one? Got it, Whoa. Uh, what just happened? Because I could have sworn that said I had two minutes. Apollo is trying to stop me from interfacing. Oh no! Amanda! You need to manually disconnect the system! Please! Jesus, Samuels, I'll try! Wait! I reiterate my statement that you are terribly designed, if that's the case. There we go. Halt the grid purge. Now, if Apollo really wanted to disconnect Samuels, the absolute easiest thing it could possibly do would be to just disconnect the network connection. What is killing me? Yeah. Anyways, the, the absolutely easiest thing it would do would be to disconnect the, the network connection to that reformat thing. It's like, that would be so easy. That's what you do in the event of an emergency hack. Like if someone is hacking you and you can't stop them, you pull out you you pull out the Ethernet cable, you stop connection to the internet. It makes no sense that it is trying to absolutely destroy him. Like unless Seekson and Wayland Yutani have the most out of control, like, intercompany rivalry I've ever heard of. Which honestly actually doesn't sound that strange. This makes no sense. Like Power is going nuts in here. We're seeing all of these different flares, and I have no idea what's causing them or why they're there. I, it's just this is way over the top. This is like this. This is hack the planet level of crazy. Let's see, yellow is over here. Blue is here. Red is over there. And wait, no, blue is over here. Okay. Because something tells me the color of these is going to be useful. Okay, green. Green is over here, blue is over here. Okay. Right. Let's do this again. And apparently I'm going to have to take cover somewhere sharpish.
this one? Oh wait, no, that's black. Ah, right, that might have been my problem. There we go. It's a dark blue. It's a navy. It's hard to tell in dark conditions. Got it. Blue disconnected. What next? I'm having trouble accessing the schematics. Okay, well green is over here. Yeah, it's this one. Whoa! Not what I want to do. <laughs> Accidentally just shot the transformer. Does that qualify for turning it off? Probably not. By which you mean an android whose head you thoroughly pummeled, but sure. Mind you, if I was, did, like, responsible for the design of this system, I also would not have these, like, arcing conduits on the top of these access things. Like, that would just be a terrible plan. Also, I love that every time I got it wrong, even the slightest bit, it killed me. Like, I've killed... I have, I have accidentally killed allies and civilians before, and it's just failed me with the message of, don't kill allies or civilians. This is just actually like murdered me. Nope, door's still closed. see in the first movie there was ash Ricardo if you who... pick up ah, doors open uh, who is like was like the tech he, he was the influence that made uh, Ellen Ripley and his mother um, despise androids for basically the entire rest of the series I'm gonna go straight there and in the second movie there was Bishop uh, who sets more or less I guess the precedent for Samuels. Uh, he is the first one who is completely, like, uh, altruistic. Let's see, take private transit to the Apollo core. I have run past it completely. Uh, oh, is it this one? Must be. Ooh, stuffs. Flare. Don't need. Blasting cap, need. Apparently. Or, I guess I just have, like, not max it out yet. Uh, ooh, bolt gun ammo. Wait, bolt gun ammo? I don't have a bolt gun. <laughs> okay, I guess we figured out what number four in my, like, weapon selection list is. Um. Nothing here, okay. Where do I go? Way back in here, apparently. But I did not. Did not Oh, th this whole section opened. I hadn't noticed it at all. Okay, well, I get the feeling I'll be glad I went backwards. Here? Oh, right, yeah. Stealthy, stealthy me. Come on. Yeah, let's just take the floor panel, shall we? Because I feel like that will be the smartest option. Ooh. Watch as I just like go down this car this like narrow corridor of tunneling and trigger like every single mildly asleep android above me. But yes, yeah, just I can understand it from like a gameplay point of view, but that whole sequence made like no sense whatsoever from a computer engineering or computer science kind of view. Oh, come on, be taking it.
Ooh, and apparently I can't craft more of these, but I can just get it ready, which is fine by me. Okay, by the sounds of it, we have woken somebody up. Okay, I need to go this way because there's no exit otherwise. If we're lucky, he's not going to wake up everybody. I say if we're lucky. In this game, that's not very likely. Thinking about it. Uh, did I miss anything from around here? Okay, you're over here. I could just totally leg it. I have a star- I have a charge left in my stun baton. But I'm gonna have to whack him like eight times before he's actually like dead. Don't mind me. I don't know why you're up, but I'm not going to help you get anything done, including filling your human murdering quota. <laughs> okay. Let's save, because that's always a pain to go through. Loop. Okay, so private was this way. Jeez, that's noisy. Oh, hey! The thing came along this time. Which means I don't have to do another jumping puzzle. Also, I really don't know what's up with all of these, like, winding, s vaguely c cylindrical corridors. Okay. What we got? Taylor? Yeah. Okay. Oi. Really? Hmm. I want data. I know red light is a secure sign in the future. All data you have on the origin of that organism. I can give you that. And a way off the station. You just have to let me out. I can probably agree to those terms. What the fuck? Oh, that's probably... No, that's actually probably the, the, the second guy, she swear. Get me out! Okay... So, Taylor and Marlowe probably survived? I, I say probably, but who knows. Ah, come on, where's our next stop? Now, the question I have to ask is, what does Marlowe want to do outside the station? I mean, besides escape, obviously. I suppose if he does have a way off the station, that, that's probably a good sign for us. Ooh, hello. Don't know if I have to be quiet. Probably gonna have to deal with him. Because this is a noisy, noisy thing. Let's see, Solomon's habitation. Let's bring in my hut though. Uh, let me see. Doesn't have a. I've never, I've never wanted more for a "you are here" sign. Seeks and synthetic to Apollo Core's blue line. So Simet to Solomon's habitation. That's sort of what we're looking for. We really want to go over and whack him. Because I'm pretty sure he's probably guarding some decent loot. But we'll leave him alone for now. Also, interesting that they opened the interior before the exterior. Seems like a safety hazard. Right. Apollo Core. Tally ho! What what? Collect blueprints to help Rippy learn how to craft different and improved devices. 
Well, she's a trained engineer. I would almost expect her to know how to make this stuff already. Granted, we're making improvised explosive devices a lot of the time, so I can understand why that might not be standard, like, tutelage. Didn't stop my teenage years, though. Just saying. Alright, where are we? I'm guessing not... Oh, thank you, Ricardo. Right. What what does that actually mean? Like real talk for a moment. What does that actually describe? Ooh, ID tag, bonding agent. Like what what do you mean talk to me exactly? Like will there be tea and crumpets? Ooh, will it have jam? Oh, I hope it has jam. I haven't had jam and crumpets like forever. Get that crafted up. That's. Yep, that is everything now. I can craft no more. Passenger inebriation. Okay, what we got here? Uh, empty on personal. Uh, tomorrow together. Hazard containment. I swear we've heard that name before. Firearms detected. You oh, seriously? Be shitting me. <laughs> Firearms on security conveyor. You kidding? All right, all right, all right. This seems like a very bad idea. This is Half-Life 2 entering the Citadel kind of thing here, and I'm totally not getting those back. Can't I grab them right now, or do you have to actually detect them? I don't like this. This is removing agency from the player. I've been through how many different transit stations before and you didn't care? Why care now? Do you not have them all? Okay, so you detect when I walk through there, but I walked through here before. Grr. Passcode. Check the Apollo sales. Oh, hello. This thing. Okay. Oh, convenient. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. I can use that. Hey. Turn off the electrics, take some deep breaths, squeeze. Easy. <laughs> now is a great time for comedy, Ricardo. Good to know you've got your you've got your uh cheaperness back. Okay, power down the conduit. From probably I want to say that room I came in through. Yeah, probably through here. In the utilities, is it? No, nothing there. Uh, no. No. What does... This does not know at all. Uh, okay. This could get a little long. Uh, no, there's nothing over here to interact with. Can't go through there. Nothing here. Nothing here. How do I power? Oh, hello. Charge back, which I maxed out on. And I imagine going to be a bigger issue. Yikes. I have one charge in my stun baton. 
apparently I have the passcode to this, but I have no idea what it is. Try oh, try to remember this time. 4930. Okay, first time I've actually had to check that. Because I did not see that on the blueprint. Is that seriously... Oh yeah, try to remember this time. 4930. Didn't see it, because she wasn't looking anywhere near there. Yep. I'll have to power it down first. Won't help. Anyways, with that, I'll get you all.